Good morning, everyone. I'm on the vlogging grind. I'm on the vlogging grind and I'm also on the TikTok grind at the moment, <laughs> weirdly. This is what happens when I have a bit more time. I get carried away and excited. Uh, but it's <laughs> another day. It's actually the next day since I vlogged last, which is literally called daily vlogging, isn't it? And I am up and at it. I'm gonna make some porridge. I have no idea what today consists of, but a lot of you say that you actually enjoy that when my vlogs are just very random, I guess. This is day three of the eyebrows and you can already see they're starting to not be as dark. That one's probably a little bit darker than that one at the moment, but yeah, much, much better, isn't it? Like that looks so good. I'm so happy with that. How the tables have turned. I'm now taking you to the station today. Yep. I was actually meant to go in to London as well to have an acting lesson, but my acting can't behind you. Oh no! Hey, oh, no. All right, we're good. I was parked up, but I was kind of parked in a wrong area. Mars. Um. Yeah, you do look like Marv from <laughs> Home Alone. Uh, yeah, I was meant to go into London with Joe today because I was going to go off to my acting lesson. Joe has a meeting. But my acting coach is not very well, so I've had to cancel that. Which is fine, because it's a rainy day. It's quite nice to be at home for a rainy day. But you know me. I'll probably go and... Do you know where I really want to go today? Oh, uh, that little trinket shop down the road. Right? Oh, yeah. No, that shop as well. Uh. Trinket shop down the road. But also that Emporium. Emporium. The one that you hate, but I love. Oh, uh, yeah, you can go there. I don't hate it. I, it's just not my cup of tea. It's not your cup of tea. I love it. Tell way I thought you were saying was that furniture shop we went to. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Joe took me to this furniture place, which I'm not going to name it, but it wasn't the best. It was actually quite creepy. It, did, was... it did have a hospital bed in it. Yeah, I, had it. I think that's what... And a used one. Like that's not... what made it weird. Was it was like an old hospital, hospital bed, bed in there? With blood stains on it. So, it? yeah, there was literally blood stains on it. Anyway, is that your your train? Right, I'll see you when you get home. Yeah, what do you is. want for dinner? Um, do you know what I should make? Like a one-pot curry. Oh uh, no, don't! Because next week I've got two one-pot one-potters. Oh orders. dear. Yeah. Oh, you could. So don't don't do, do me no, one pot. No, not I not think, a one pot. Um, not a one-pot wonder. What about? Oh, just, oh, good, just a pasta. A spaghetti bolognese. Okay. I love a spaghetti bolognese. So I got to do some grocery shopping With today. With garlic so. bread. Okay. Uh, do you do instead? Get this car, sort yourself out. I cleaned this car the other day. No, I know, but you should, um, you should clean it. I cleaned again. it. <laughs> <laughs> you haven't cleaned the back. No, I only did the front. Start looking at maybe a, a different car. I think you need something. From looking at your parking the other day, I think you need something that you press a button and it parks for you, like parallel parks. That's true. I think I look, look at minis still because mini. I think like so too. Car. I like a mini. And a Tesla, because I'm looking at electric, by the way. A Tesla for me, I think, is just a bit too lush and extravagant. And I feel like I'm just not that. Yeah. So I'm well, I'm no. feeling I'm feeling a mini. Sorry, you said I'm not your favorite. I went, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me how you really yeah, feel, Joseph. Yeah, my skin looking good. Yeah, much better. I've been really doing my skin routine. Have you? Yeah. Well done. Very glowy, actually. <laughs> Bye. I am out and about. The little emporium that I was talking about um, to Joe is permanently closed, which is really upsetting because I really, really wanted to uh, go there, but not to worry. Alrighty, come grocery shopping with me. What do we need? Kind of want to get some more flowers. Now, Joe said he wanted spaghetti bolognese, so we need to get things for that. Onion. I am obsessed with dates, so they are going straight in my basket. done still raining shock oh how do i get my pound coin out do i just take it out what do i do i don't get it ah i see gotta click it in no guys 
How do I get my pound coin out? What do I do? Like, surely it should come out. Got it. Got back home and, oh, not gonna fall. I've got a meeting in like 10 minutes. Bless Joey. He messaged me on my way home because he's been in London, he's back now. He's also in a meeting upstairs. Um, and he's like, I don't feel very well. Can you make me a lem sit? I'm making a little lem sit. Bless him. Also, this here, I want to show you something I saw on TikTok and I want to try and make. It's um, tofu without the soya, which, because I don't really like soya, but I actually really like tofu. So apparently you can make it with these red split lentils. So I'm going to give that a go and do it in the air fryer. Looks amazing. Oh my God. Also, I bought some cottage cheese, mustard and hearts of palm because I don't know if you've seen a Tiffany plate from a girl on TikTok. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed with the Tiffany plate. So I'm probably going to do a Tiffany plate at some point. Yes, I am. I'm that girl. I'm a bit obsessed with her. Dinner. <laughs> My pretty little golden man, Englishman. Joe's just completed Tomb Raider 1. Tomb Raider 1. He played it with his dad back in 1996. 1996. You would have been six years old. No, no five. Four, even. Yeah, I, it came out in 1996, but I think I bought it a bit later on. Oh. I feel like... I feel like I need to give you a little trophy or something. Don't need to. I've got my trophies. Do you have tears in your eyes? No. I think you have tears in your I've eyes. I've got a head cold. I think you're teary. Feeling under weather. I'm not I'm not crying. I think you're teary about completing it. No, not at all. Just look, Stephen Cattrall, senior infrastructure engineer. You have this you have Luke Nijalfa. Alexander, Wyatt Johnson, all these guys. They were legends. Andrew Boswell. Wow, <laughs> amazing. Zachary Moyer. <laughs> yeah, completed. It's the next day of what I was filming yesterday and such a sweet lighting in here. There you go. Final statistics. Oh. It took me twelve. You've been on this for 12 hours. Not in one go. Over the course of like, when it's Valentine's Day. It's nearly a that, month. Nearly a month. No. Oh yeah, yeah actually nearly a month. I've actually traveled, four, I've done 43 Ks. So it's exercise. Wow. I've only used, I used 44 Medipack. That is amazing. My ammo, I had, I killed 240 things. Only 12 secrets out of 45. I'm going to have to replay it and find all the secrets. I'm so proud of you. Yeah. I'm different. so glad I was here. Mark's almost... Yeah, I know. You're getting really into it towards I the end. I was. It was really I'm fun. Send this to Mark, because Mark's also playing this game. Good morning, everyone. <laughs> it's a brand new day, and I've decided to make a TikTok, and I need my fringe for that. Now, the fringe I found in the bottom of my hair drawer. <laughs> yes, I have a hair drawer. Oh, and I have blueberry all over my face from my smoothie. Um... <clears throat> Yes, I thought I'll just pick up the vlog here. It is the next day, so now it's, a, now it's a Saturday. It's again another rainy day out there. I can see the the rain pouring down. We really can't catch a break. A few things I want to do today, but yeah, the first thing I want to tackle is a TikTok. So yeah, I'm going to go do that now. And it might not be a TikTok, it might even be for my Instagram reel. I don't know. Let's see how it goes. Little winky wink is a Claudia Winkleman one. So, oh, that, that kind of worked, didn't it? Little winky wink. Kind of feel like I need some black eyeliner to put on. <laughs> so I might take some of that down with me. I would film the process, but I kind of need my phone and I film on my phone, so I'm not gonna film the process. This has been such a random little vlog. I've got bits and pieces. Do you know, I, sh I, I filmed Joe going to the grocery store and everything I put in my trolley. <laughs> like, who even cares? I mean, I love grocery yeah. shopping. I'm interested to know what you put in your trolley. Yeah, anyway, 
uh, we are now off to my fav one of my favorite little stores. I feel like I say that about every single shop that I go to um, because there is a chair there that I really want to get. And I've always needed Joe's car to be able to get it. So we are off to the little store and the sun. Oh my gosh, the sun. I forgot my purse. Tell you what you love, Joe. What? Those orange pants. These orange pants and my hat. And that hat. You absolutely love those pants. I've seen you in them every day this week. Yeah. Congratulations. I famously don't wash them. <laughs> I was really awkward then. I didn't. I didn't commit. I didn't commit to the chair. Yeah, but, you, but also, you but I going, feel like we should have committed. We got into the shop. No, see, you're gonna, you're gonna be so annoyed when we get home. I'm gonna, gonna be so annoyed. You look at your room and go, yeah, I do want it. And I do. I said, look, you stood in there. You awkwardly walked around the shop. <laughs> you went downstairs. You didn't need to. And I was like, you get it or not? It's yeah. Part, it's like a part of a display. It is a part of a display. So you have to move loads of stuff to get to it. And am, am I doing the wrong thing by not getting it? It's too late now. No. I think you need to learn. Oh, no. <laughs> so well, no, instead, I went to the little, like, corner store, which is gorgeous, by the way. It's a little fruit and veg store. And I got some flowers, and that's made me very happy. <laughs> bless you. Yeah, sorry. It wasn't a real, um, <laughs> bless you again. The thing that made me laugh, I then went into this shop, and the guy is, the shop is tiny, right? And Diane turns to me and goes, how much do you reckon these flowers are? <laughs> So I looked at you and just went, I just turned around and asked the guy, <laughs> how much are these flowers? I was very awkward. Why was yeah, it so you, awkward? You, you went proper awkward. Yeah, I really want that chair though. Damn it. I'm so annoyed about that. <sighs> it's lovely to get out and have a walk around though, isn't it? Yeah. Anyway, we have some beautiful flowers. Do you know what I wish we had in the back? Look, I, I, was, chair. I was shocked. It's because I'm it's not, not sure like if, you. maybe I'm just not sure if I want that chair or not. I think you... I just haven't you you've wanted to go down to look to do it but then you realized actually i don't know where it's going to go <laughs> yeah that's true i do not know where it's going to go and i assumed it was going in your dressing room, dressing room. Mm, which would make sense really not to oh, worry it's... i'm not worried about it i'm not really that worried about it at all it's oh. not like i'm not th i'm not thinking about yeah, it at all in the car I'm not even worried about it at all. You are. I'm not even like that upset that I'm not going to be getting out my new chair from the boot. It doesn't really bother me at all. I'm not that upset about it. I'm going to do a little rearranging with the flowers because actually I don't have as many vases as I thought. My new flowers to go in this big vase. But these flowers, I'm going to cut the stems a little bit and put them into this little jar. So I'm gonna, yeah, do a little bit of rearranging. I don't know if anyone cares, but I put these ones here and they are gorgeous. I quite like the fact they have the long stem and I think they frame the kitchen gorgeous. And then I put the leftover in this little cute vase and oh yeah and the rest by the way these are the ones that have lasted me for almost a year now in the same shop and they're still alive now so i think they all last a very long time and then the leftover leftovers i put on the table here there is just something about flowers that i just love good morning it's sunday morning i've woke up Joseph is not here. He was um, filming something in Glasgow yesterday. So he left yesterday. He's coming back today. Well, tonight. So I have a whole day. A whole day of just mooching about on a Sunday. Going to go have my coffee, make some breakfast, do a workout. All the morning things that make me feel super amazing in the morning. So let's go do it. I made my smoothie this morning with half an avocado as well. Oh my God. Such a game changer with the avocado. It makes it so like creamy. Mmm. Love it. Oh, and also, I'm drinking it from a beer glass. <laughs> Smoothie was absolutely delicious. I have the remains still on my mouth. I'm yet to shower and wash and do all that stuff. I've just done a big clean. I put some washing on, tidied downstairs, and I'm now changing the sheets. I know that sounds so bloody boring, but it's just 
it's so refreshing. So it's time to change the sheets. I've already stripped the bed. When I say new sheets, I've got new sheets straight from the packet. My mum would probably say you need to wash them first before you put them on. But I mean, it's they're literally coming out of a packet. I mean, I can see her point. Uh, and I'm sure a lot of people on here will have their opinion that I should have washed the sheets before I put them on. But I'm just going to put them on. Oh my gosh, this is gorgeous. These are a 300 thread count. It's all about the thread count, apparently. So Joe tells me. A new matching duvet as well. I think if there could be a, a job that is my least favourite thing to do, it would actually be this. Joe says, get a corner and then find this corner. Why are so many buttons? Yes, she's got it. Right, I think I've done it. Oh no, what have I done? Yeah, buttons wrong. Mission almost complete. I also must admit, Joe makes the bed every single morning. Also, something that um, I've been me meaning to share with you guys for ages and I haven't because I've just <sighs> not had time. I've actually, she sent it to me when I was away on tour. Let me just tie this mop up. It's Rock and Doll and they have the most amazing pillowcases and hair scrunchies. I'll just read it to you. Hydrate your skin and hair with a silk material that is less moisture absorbent compared to fabrics like cotton and bamboo, effectively sealing in natural moisture and eliminating frizz. Benefit from the antibacterial properties of silk, which is naturally hypo, hypoallergenic, keeping you safe from harmful bacteria. Reduce breakage with silk's tight wave and unique properties that minimize friction against hair and skin. It's Rock and Doll and it's this beautiful silk pillowcase. I'll leave a link in my description box for Rock and Doll. She is my hairdresser as well. Um, this was gifted to me, but it's beautiful. This is her. She is absolutely beautiful. She also sent me a little um, discount code. So I'm going to put that in my description as well. So if you guys want to try it out, it'd be such a beautiful gift to give someone. I've just done my quick little face routine and uh, obviously New Nordic. It's not an ad, but I do work with the brand. So, um, but I love them and I legit use it every day. As you can see, I have put dents. When I say dents, dents in my creams <laughs> because I use them a lot. Anyway. I am getting ready to go to HomeSense and TK Maxx. Just made it to TK Maxx. I didn't go to HomeSense in the end because it was a lot further away than I thought it was. Uh, usually Joe drives there and I didn't really want to do a big old drive. So I'm at TK Maxx and also Lidl. I love a bit of Lidl, so I'm going to have a look in Lidl as well. Um, but first, TK Maxx. First thing as I walk in a portable humidifier i need this for my car my car smells really bad and i think i'm gonna get it perfect for cars desks nightstands hotel rooms and more i'm getting it done oh portable usb mm, that's the only thing i don't know how i would plug that into my car i'll figure it out oi oi that i actually was in there for so long um i did get some bits and i did end up getting that uh, diffuser and I've figured out how to turn on so I'm gonna do that now oh my battery's low need that to get home so I will do a proper little haul when I get home but for now what I did buy is a car charger then I need to put this on because my car freaking stinks this is the portable aroma air freshener and it does say for cars so I'm guessing what do I do with it what would Joe say to me? Dot, read the packaging. Okay, help if it was in English. Okay, there's an English here. Okay. That was a really brief little. We may need to just turn the car on, I think. Oi! Shut up! Okay, wait. Oh. Unexpected upgrade, especially if you don't. Shh. I even bought some eucalyptus drops natural eucalyptus right let's put a little bit of water into it do let's put a couple of drops of my eucalyptus oil let's get this car smelling good that was more than a couple of drops but that's all right pop this on 
Where am I going to put her so she doesn't fling about? Just down by the passenger seat there. There's a little archive where she won't go anywhere. And guys, I will give you a haul when I get back. Hopefully that aroma is going to go through the, through the car. And it's going to be lovely. When I pick up Joe next time, he'll be like, I'm sorry, what? Your car smells good. Right. Let's go home. And I'm back. What is this music? Right, I'm gonna show you this little hole from TK Maxx. I actually chickened out. I wanted to get these two cushions, which I kind of wish I had got now. But I always need Joe's advice for housey stuff in terms of like decor or decor, however you call it. They were cute, but I just don't think Joe would like them. So I just went, no, nah, I'm not gonna do it. Anyway, I'll show you what I got. I really love these and they're gonna go in my office. So it's like this big, kind of looks like a book. That kind of looks like a book. And that looks like a book. So like a beautiful little stack of books for the office. However, they're not just a book. You can put stuff inside, which I think is super cool. And I will link these on my LTK because they are so cute. And I will show you as well when I stack them in there. I just, I loved that. And they were really good price as well. Like the biggest one was $9.99. They look like proper little books and they're just so cute. I just love the look of a book. And it's got two purposes. And also just like put things in there that are kind of out and I don't need them out. Do you know what I mean? Oh, I'm excited for this as well. I hardly wear my Apple Watch. I love it, just hardly wear it. And I've always wanted a different band for it because it's a white one and the white one gets really, really dirty. From TK Maxx, they have a range called Isla Ray, which again, I will also uh, tag this on my LTK. And this was literally $9.99. All right, and that kids at Christmas, that would open everything straight away. Are you that kid? <laughs> or is it just me? Someone please say yes in the comments that you're that kid. I have a very small wrist, so this is gonna be very big for me. Later on today, I will actually put my Apple Watch onto it. Oh, that's so cute though. Look how gorgeous that is. It comes with this little kit so you can make it smaller as well. But I love that so much. I'll keep those little instructions. I need Joe to do it for me. <laughs> what else did we get? Oh, this I love. So this is a wooden chopping board because I have thrown out all my plastic chopping boards. I just decided, no, nope, they're going. I have heard so many bad things about plastic chopping boards. So I bought this beautiful, beautiful chopping board that can actually stay out and you just have to clean it down. So, probably gonna put it like there. Oh, I love it! Manakada Beauty. Manakada. Manakada. All these lip colors, which mm, they look great. Right up my street. All these kind of lip colors. Let's try one out now. This one really took my fancy and they were 6.99 for an eight piece lip color uh they're shiny okay that's fine ah uh, they're lip stains that's why okay they're a lip stain liquid lip stain so it will like stain your lips but i just thought all those colors that's a good palette of color isn't it so I couldn't go past that. I bought immunity blend, essential immunity blend of cocoa powder, turmeric, ginger, black pepper, added vitamin C and B6. Perfect for hot chocolate smoothies and shakes. You know how they have all these like bits and bobs at TK Maxx? Well, this one looked good, so I got that. Um, oh my God, this, oh, this is, so, it's an it's a it's a fake Joe Malone, Olivia Blake. This was nine ninety nine. The bottle looks the same. It's like that is the same. 
it, it's so cute. And honestly, it's stronger than Jo Malone. And like, I smell this more than the Jo Malone one. I sprayed it in the shop and I was like, oh my God, I have to buy that. There was another one there, which I really wanted, but they were sold out of it. It was peony, um, a peony one, but I ended up going for lime blossom and basil. Still really good, but the other one was better. So I will definitely tag these in my LTK as well because what a bargain. And sm honestly, mm, it smells so good. Um, gosh, I did more than a four. Oh, I got a little battery power because I am going into London a lot these days and I need a battery plug. And then I just got a couple of little clothing items. I got this skirt, which was a bit random, but I loved it. I got these on sale. Really comfortable. Ivy Park, Adidas. Uh, leggings, can't go past a legging. I mean, I wear them every day. And I got a jacket, which I'll show you when I'm upstairs because it's so nice. And I want to style it properly. So that was my little haul. I'm going to put some stuff away now. That was fun though. I enjoyed it. And it's chill time. I've been in the sauna. I didn't do ice bath today. What I did do is just like put my head in. But as of next week, well, tomorrow is next week, I am going to definitely get back on the ice bath. It's been a few days now since I've done an ice bath and I miss it. So that will be starting again as of tomorrow. Um, but yeah, I'm literally just chilling here on a little cane lounge trying to cool down because I was sweating in that sauna. I started watching, cause like in the sauna, there's a, um, like a thing in the wall where you can watch like Netflix and stuff whilst you're sat in there. And I was starting to watch Manifest and actually it's really good. I was getting quite into it, but I was getting so hot that I was like, right, I need to, I haven't finished a full episode yet. Cause it was just a bit too much for me. So yeah, I might go up and do a little bit of baking or I don't know. I want to make something. So I'm going to go and have a look at some recipes and I'm sure I'll let you know what I end up making. But for now, Sunday chill, waiting for Joe to get home. Dinner time. I was so close to ordering something, but then I thought there's no point in ordering anything. I have bits and pieces of food in the fridge. So I've just come up with another random sort of dinner. Um, I had some sweet potato that I've put in the oven and made like sweet potato wedges. I had some potatoes that I've microwaved actually. Um, and I have some mushrooms and spinach that I'm just gonna saute up now. So actually I, I have enough to create a meal and I'm so proud of myself that I didn't be tempted to just be like, oh, I'll just order something in. Cause I had stuff, I don't wanna waste it. So I'm really happy. Uh made something out of nothing. I sauteed the vegetable together. I got some sweet potatoes, some potato, very potato heavy. Um, and I made a little sour cream and um, a sriracha sauce to go with the sweet potato wedges. So that is a pretty good Sunday dinner. I had myself a nice little bath. Joe is still not home. It's taking quite a long time to uh, get back. But what I wanted to do is sort this out what i got today this little um band for my apple watch oh gosh okay wow well we have one that's come out oi that looks sick that was actually easier than i thought success it actually looks so cute i really love that little band for my Apple Watch, I now need to charge my Apple Watch so that I can wear it tomorrow. I'm gonna pretend to Joe. Like oh I've read heaps of my books, so he has to give me a thousand pound. He's coming up now. This is a terrible angle. <laughs> <laughs> what? I've read. Do you know what page I'm up to? Five hundred. I'm up to five hundred and thirty. You are not. I swear down. What's so far then? So it's all about this guy called it. And he lives under a, um, like, okay, what do you call it, sewage. What's the boy's name, then? Oh, gosh, I can't remember. It's written on the first page. You actually read the one page. <laughs> I've read... Where's, where's the camera? <laughs> 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 no. 
Damn, I can't trick him. He's going to quiz me. I'm not going to get this thousand pound. <laughs>